Hello children, good morning. Once again, you are joining me, Abdul Rahman, your host for our English course. We studied that there are four basic skills that you have to master in English language. The last one is writing skill. So today, in test number six of GCE ordinary paper, we are going to master that skill. In test number skill, you either have to do one of two things. You have to write a note, which is informal, or you have to write a notice, which is formal. The marking scheme for this is, you get two marks for the content, which is only 50 words maximum, and then you get three marks for your language, which is English. Now, how to write a note? Usually, in 2018 was the year that you got a note recently. In 2018, the note format is like this. When you are writing a note, you have to include a date, which is optional. A salutation, for example, dear brother, dear sister, dear friend, and you have to include the message. And finally, you have to write the name of the sender. For example, if I am sending a message to my friend Husni, I will write Dear Husni and I will write the message and finally put my name which is Abdul. I don't have to write the whole name with initials. I don't have to write. This short name is enough. Right. Now look at 2018 note that was given to you. I hope that you can read the note here. They have asked you to include three things in this note if you can look at properly. What you want to do is clearly read the note, the question that has been given and how the answer has been formed. A friend is going to another friend's house to meet him but that friend is not there. So what is the solution? He is keeping a note for him telling him that he came to visit his friend and the reason why he came to visit his friend and asking him to call back. So we have structured the answer in a very simple and elegant way. So I want you to read the answer very carefully and understand how the question has been transformed into a note. Now, notice. Writing a note, you don't have to follow a specific format. But to make it easier for you, my dear children, I have put up a format. In this format, I have given you one as notice, the title, which is what you are going to write like Shramada and a campaign or something like that. Then you have to write the name of the association or the committee and of what the school or whatever that is given there. And then you have to write the day and time. So now look at this structure very carefully. You are going to use whatever the note is that you get in your overall paper into this structure. If you can memorize this structure, you can use this structure to any of the notice that you have to write. For example, take 2019 OL paper. I have used the same structure to input various parts. I would like to remind you when you V E N U E means place. The message is what you have to say. All are welcome, great nine students are welcome, please bring this and that. That is the structure that you have. Right. Now children, today you have studied two things, note and notice. I will give you some activities that you can see here and I want you to complete these activities and send me. And here is a bonus for you. Whatever the note or notice that you send, I will definitely correct it and send it back to you. See you. Bye bye.